spread that out over more than one day. I don't even want to think about how many lives were lost on that mountaintop. A lot of good men and women didn't make it out of there. For days now, we've been staring at the breach, watching demons and maker knows what fall out of it. Bad for morale would be an understatement. I still can't believe anyone was in there and lived. The breach needs to be sealed. The sooner the better. If it can be sealed, you might want to consider running at the first opportunity. I've written enough tragedies to recognize where this is going. Heroes are everywhere. I've seen that. But the hole in the sky... That's beyond heroes. We're going to need a miracle. That's inspiring. enough out of you. I'm not even going to say goodbye. The game was a freaking traitor. Hey everybody. Hey Liliana. What's up? Blessed are the peacekeepers. The champions of the just. Blessed are the righteous. The lights in the shadow. In their blood, the Maker's will is written. Is that what you want from us? Blood? To die so that your will is done? Is death your only blessing? You speak for Andraste, no? No. What does the Maker's prophet have to say about all of this? What's his game? I speak for no one but myself, and I have no answers for you. Then we can only guess at what he wants. The Chantry teaches that the Maker abandoned us. He demands repentance for our sins. He demands it all. Our lives, our deaths. Justinia gave him everything she had, and he let her die. Maybe you should be angry at the people who murdered her. If the Maker doesn't intervene to save the best of his servants, what good is he? I used to believe I was chosen. Just as some say you are, I thought I was fulfilling his purpose for me, working with the divine, helping people. But now she's dead. It was all for nothing. Serving the Maker meant nothing. Maybe you have another purpose. I could help you find it. No, this is my burden. I regret that I even let you see me like this. It was a moment of weakness. It won't happen again. Come, to work then. We will speak later. 
<laughs> Fine. Oh, what's going on here? Your kind killed the most holy. Lies. Your kind let her die. Shut your mouth, mate! Enough! Knight Captain! That is not my title. We are not Templars any longer. We are all part of the Inquisition. And what does that mean, exactly? Back already, Chancellor. Haven't you done enough? I'm curious, Commander, as to how your Inquisition and its herald will restore order as you've promised. Of course you are. Back to your duties, all of you. Oh, let's go deal with this here and now. Mages and Templars were already at war. Now they're blaming each other for the Divine's death. Which is why we require a proper authority to guide them back to order. Who? You? Random clerics who weren't important enough to be at the Conclave. The Rebel Inquisition and its so-called Herald of Andraste? I think not. If the proper authority hadn't completely failed, the Conclave wouldn't have been needed. So you suggest I blame the church and exalt a murderer? What of justice? That won't help restore order in the here and now. <laughs> order will never be restored so long like this as this rebellion is allowed to fester. Remind me why you're allowing the Chancellor to stay. Clearly your Templar knows where to draw the line. He's toothless. There's no point turning him into a martyr simply because he runs in the mouth. The chance is a good indicator of what to expect in Val Royale. The mages and Templars are fighting, even though we don't know what really happened at the Temple of Sacred Ashes. Exactly why all this should be left to a new divine. If you are innocent, the Chantry will establish it as so. Or we'll be happy to use someone as a scapegoat. You think nobody cares about the truth? We all grieve at Justinia's loss. But you won't grieve in the Herald of Andraste is conveniently swept under a carpet. I'll make sure they see reason in Val Royale. Pray you're right. I still want to punch this dude. I punch the dude button. Self, dude. Andraste, a blessed hero sent to save us all. I've no interest in being a hero. All I want is to find a way to seal this breach. Pragmatic, but ultimately irrelevant. I've journeyed deep into the fade in ancient ruins and battlefields to see the dreams of lost civilizations. I've watched as hosts of spirits clash to reenact the bloody past in ancient wars, both famous and forgotten. Every great war has its heroes. I'm just curious what kind you'll be. The kind who wins. That is usually better than losing. I will stay, at least until the breach has been closed. Was that in doubt? I am an apostate surrounded by Chantry forces in the middle of a mage rebellion. Cassandra has been accommodated, but you understand my caution. Cassandra trusts you. She won't let anyone put you into a circle against your will. Thank you. I appreciate your thought. But now let us hope either the mages or the Templars have the power to seal the breach. Your house sucks, dude. <clears throat> no loot. Ah, the apothecary. Upgrade potions. Okay, so that's what I need blood lotus for. So I make anti from fire. Oh, 
causing 46 burning damage every second to the enemy or I remains for 30 seconds. It's a decent amount of damage. If I could get them to stand in it. Told me that he can't let the herbs go for anything less than eight. Fine. We'll gather our own. Tell Segrit. He better hope he doesn't need a soul anytime soon. Huh. <laughs> Look who's back from the dead. Again. My thanks for any part you played in that. Yeah. Well, you can pay me back by fixing the wood. Name's Adan. I'm in charge of keeping our little band here stocked with potions and elixirs. Not that seeker Pentagast seems to care whether we've got the supplies to actually do that. Is there anything I can do to help out? We're fine as far as raw labor goes. You've more important things to do than tend to me. I only wish I'd been able to find Master Tajin's notes. Old bastard was working on something special. He died at the Conclave, and his notes weren't here. Been too busy dealing with the wounded to look for them. For a healer, you don't seem particularly nurturing. I'm not a healer. I'm an alchemist who's forced to play Mother Hen. You want something to burst into flame on contact with the air? Done. Gladly. Patching up wounded soldiers is a waste of my time and talents, but there are a few around who can help. How are your people holding up? We've got Mother Giselle lending a hand now, which helps. For the ones that need comforting more than actual healing, she's a rock in fast water. Something to cling to. How do I go about having potions made? Just take a look there and tell me what you'd like. Find a recipe for something better, I can make that too. So I can research potions here. Takes 18 elf root and one royal elf root to research increased duration on a regen potion. So let's research that. And on a, my normal healing potions, I can research nothing. Because I don't have a dawn lotus. So let's use this. second royal elf root I have to increase healing factor as well. I have no tonics. I can increase its damage. I need dragon thorns and dawn lotus. But I think my dawn lotus is also needed for my healing potions. Yes it is. So it won't go towards that. If I equip potions, yes, now I have other things. Alright, so it takes an elf root to make a regen potion and a blood lotus for one of these. So, the clutch. Okay, so there's my life there gem type things. Made some potions, life is good. Next I have to go to the war room. Uh -huh. Stuff. Can I not summon my horse? Damn. The war room I think is inside. I will keep the peace while you and the others appeal to the Chantry from Balroya. Better ready yourself for the blade, or you will be rightly assigned. I don't really want to kill that guy. Let all repeat the chant of light. Only the word shows the darkness upon us. There's a shiny crystal thing. Very nice. 
です。